So I saw this team floating around and it was basically just changing Langris for Mimosa and playing a bit more conservatively. I saw Anto do it and I saw a couple other people do it. So I thought, why not? Now, very quickly, I'm just going to show you guys her gear because you guys keep asking, but it's always the same gear set that I have on my DPS. But whatever, it's fine. I'll keep on showing you. So magic attack and I mean, yeah, speed attack and then penetration doesn't really change much. I have crit accessories. So she's up to 84%. And this is the pieces I went for her. I decided to give her speed since she's already at 109 speed. Why not give her a bit more than defense and then uh, crit damage because I already have pretty good crit damage. So yeah, that's what I'm at. 60k CC. And I gave Fauna's uh, the other Fauna skill page. So that's basically the whole team. This is the CC. And let's just hop in. Let's fight the teams. And this team is going to be basically trying to be conservative. In that you're not going to use alt first turn. Uh, yeah, so we're not going to use alt first turn. We're just going to build up our hatred stacks. Because it's that's just how it plays out. And of course, we cannot get stunned. Three people would have gotten stunned. So that's one of the things. Whenever people try to pull that silly shit, they can't. And now we have damage reduction. So we're not going to take any damage. And it's going very well. So, you know, you love to see it. We're going to do this. And then we're going to apply... Ta oh, wow. Damn. Very good. Very good damage. Then we're going to apply taunt since we have 100% chance. So, yeah. We'll apply the taunt so she can't apply barrier. And next turn, we're going to just kill everyone. Like, guaranteed everyone's dead. Let's just see this play out. Um, thank God it wasn't Fauna, at least. That's the only person we did not want it to be. So, good job. Now, we're going to apply this debuff extension in the rare case that we do not kill. It sucks that now we cannot crit, but it's fine. Um, I'll put the... It doesn't matter because we're just about to kill. The damage from this, so it's going to be 210 plus 70. So, 280% AoE. Insane, man. Yeah, there you go. Fauna. Let's see how much damage she did. Um, I, I'm going to put Fauna in the front just because I like seeing her win. But 400k with two attacks is pretty, pretty, pretty good. Especially when they had crit re uh, crit resistance. Uh, not crit resistance, but they just were blocking crits. So yeah, now Fauna's in the front. We love to see it. Let's go on. I do think Fauna's very good. Uh, but certain team comps can for sure break her up. Especially debuffing blue teams. If it's full blue teams, it could get very tricky. Especially when there's a Charmy. But I've found her to be overall quite nice. Like, I feel like she's high S tier, low S plus tier. It's just a bit tricky sometimes, but I, I do like her. I really do like her. So I could do this. 200k. Just like, wow, man. Wow. Too good. Um, I mean, do we stop her barrier? Do we stop his barrier? Stopping his barrier isn't needed, but stopping her barrier, yeah. So we'll, we'll taunt. And it's, it's also good that we have that security. Because we already have barriers. So I do personally appreciate that. So they seem to go for the person I think with the highest magic attack. But I'm going to check that out real quick after. See if it actually is that. I Because I wonder if Fauna or Rades has more magic attack. That's going to that's, that, that's be interesting to see. So we're just going to ult right now I guess. Do we? Because we have two hatred stacks. They have no damage reduction. Yeah. We could ult. Look at that damage. Look at that. Ah, oh, unlucky. Ah, oh, she could have died. She could have died, man. But it's fine. Fauna isn't dying, so we're we're chilling. We'll just attack that. And of course, Mimosa's heals are very good. But yeah, I like this team. I think that... I don't know if it's because the teams I fought last time were a bit better. Or what was it? But I want to try fighting a full blue team with uh, Season 5 Noel. See how that plays out, because that Noel is like overpowering, man. Actually, just, just disgusting. I don't know, like on JP especially because of that event skill page, it's very tough. It's very tough because you consider that the event skill page, like you could paired up on Mars and then Charlotte's on the team, and then Mars AOE stuns plus taunts, like Jesus. But an 80k barrier is just wild to me, absolutely wild. We should still go first with uh, Charlotte, because Charlotte is the GOAT. But that means we can't get stunned by Julius, and if he debuffs us, that does suck. But Julius is definitely the one, like, pseudo counter to... Wow, that's a lot of barriers. That's the one thing, when there's barriers to this extent, these numbers, it gets very difficult. But still, pretty good damage. 
um, you can't really penetrate faunas, barriers, and they have no barrier removal, but there's okay, so I have damage reduction. Let's increase the duration of that so that she is good. And she gets damage resistance, so it's just very nice. I really do like Fauna. Fauna is uh she's that guy, I think. Now we have extra barrier of 100 k So we just play the long game, play the waiting game, and uh, we'll be fine. We're gonna put this on Charlotte, I think. Yeah, it's gonna be better on Charlotte. Get her damage reduction back in two turns about. That's going to be a bit annoying. Be oh, thank god Charlotte couldn't get debuffed. That's one thing. The debuff block on that skill is just strong as hell. Is there any... Yeah, I think it's better to just play it out. Um, it's also going to let us get an extra hatred stack. The skill 1 damage is not the craziest, but it doesn't need to be in my eyes. Still, it's... Uh, I wish it was better, but considering her skill 2 just does more than most skill 1s in the game, it's, it's fine to me. Um, yeah, we're not going to use our ultimate because that would be a, we a waste of a res for sure. It does suck when we don't use Fauna's ult right away because I feel like these skill points do go to waste. Oof. Oof. I, I should have put it now. Um, is there any counters up? No. Alright, well, everyone's dead. Yeah, everyone's dead. How much damage? Bop, bop. 745k. Ah, <sighs> my god. My god, man. My god, bro. Okay, when Fauna pulls out stuff like that, that's just raw damage. That's the thing. That's pure raw damage. But then, like, of course, if there's a Charlotte on the team. <laughs> 1 million. Insane. Fauna is so good. Like, this is making me consider S plus for her. But, like, I'll go to a team like this, and then it's just not going to work out type B, you know? It's it's very interesting with Fauna. I, I wish it was easier for me to give her those. But, oh, this team is going to be very bad for us. Magna's gonna just destroy. We're gonna need this damage reduction to carry us. Three turn. All oh right, three. I forgot Charlotte's just that crazy. Okay, thank God. Uh, if just we didn't get that counter, would have been a slightly better. Okay, well she's. Uh, of course it was Fauna. Okay, well we're gonna have to put the. E yeah, we'll put the defense. Cause next turn Magna's gonna try and he's gonna alt. So the barrier is gonna be just absolutely worthless. That is quite worrisome. But at least we have Mimosa's res. That is a very good thing. But yeah, no. Uh, we're not looking the best, but we have at least... Oh, we don't have damage res because we can't apply block. Oh, skill 2 again? Did he... How did he use his skill 2 twice? Am I tripping? Was that not his skill 2? Could have not been, I guess. Uh, do we just use it? I think it's better to use it, especially because the other people don't want to die. So yeah. If it does attack Fauna, sucks to suck, but... Hopefully it attacks Rodas, but I don't think it will. Yeah, we're going to have to play the long game for this. This one is one of those teams that, you know, it's very unpredictable. Depending on what Magna does here, we're going to have to see. Do we stop stuns just in case Fauna does live? Huh. I feel like going on Charlotte would be best. Because if Magna does kill, yeah, we're going to... This is probably best. He's going to ult. Not ult. That's completely fine by me okay um sure 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 i mean charlotte's not dying she has enough hp this i hope don't kill just don't kill just like give give me the increased defense and like yeah we're fine we're fine unless she alts here unless no alts ah okay we're good we're good no don't do anything don't do anything let me heal let me heal please 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 let me heal please Oh, what do we... Uh, th this should be enough. Well, I mean, it's going to heal, but not her full HP because Charlotte has a like, insane amount of HP. So we have four, four hatred. We should be able to pierce most of the shields. Yeah, we'll go for it. We did not. We really did not. Rodas is dying. Let's try and kill Magna. Noel, don't... Please don't barrier. Okay, we're good. Um, What do we do? We'll just do this, then we're going to ult. Because at this point, we're not dying, so... Oh, well, Magna died. Alright, perfect. That was a bit close, I'm not going to lie. That was a bit close. 60k heal. We love to see it. Oh, I should have... Bro, it's crazy that the skill 2 does more damage than the skill 1 on her. That, to me, is just, like, impressive. It's it's actually really impressive, and... um, It's kind of bad, because I don't realize it. So I'll end up using the skill 1 over the skill 2 sometimes if it's like one person left. But then it's like, oh wait, 
The skill two is actually quicker. Like, damn, okay, go Fauna, right? Go Fauna. So this is, okay, damage reduction, damage reduction, okay. If, it would be really funny if he ults with William because William cannot, he ulted, okay, guys. Damage reduction does stack, it stacks. Since when? What? Oh, is it because... Wait, it's a different type of damage reduction? Oh, this is tenacity. It's two different buffs. Oh, shit. Okay, they're literally taking pebbles. Look at that, bro. That damage reduction is insane. I guess we learn something new every day. Oh, my God. That damage reduction is like 90%. And I still did like 50k, which... Okay. Fauna went crazy, but... No, wow. I didn't know they were different types of damage reduction buffs. Because you cannot stack the same type of buffs. Like, let's say you have a buff that's level 4 magic attack and you have a buff that's level 3. The level 4 one is going to stay even if you apply the level 3 one after. Which is very silly, but yeah, I mean, it, it makes sense in a way. Um, damage, it's not worth it yet. I actually would have been worth it, shit. Yeah, it would have definitely been worth it. We, we would have killed... But yeah, the damage reduction pretty much... Oh, it's only because it wore off on Radis already. I see, I see, I see. Makes sense, makes sense. Okay. So now, uh, I mean, we ult with Fauna and then that's GG, isn't it? Well, never mind, man. Never mind. We're gonna have to wait, aren't we? Well, let's apply our hatred stacks, get up to five. Oh, wow, that's still pretty good uh, damage, but it makes sense why. Okay, well, Mimosa cannot die, please. We don't want Mimosa to die. Okay, damage reduction time. Great. Please tell me we have the skill 2 with Mimosa. Oh, shit. Oh, that's... Oh, my God, that's cringe, man. At least we could heal, but that's cringe. And he taunted us because we attacked him. Oh, man. Okay. Well, I guess we have to ult. I think this one is a loss for us. Oh. No. Why did Fauna have to die, man? One million, though. I call that a win, but at the same time, it's just... Damn. One million raw damage. That's insane. But, yeah, no. Barrier teams are still annoying against Fauna. Especially when it's double barrier. But Fauna could still cook. So I guess we'll play one more, one more, two more, one more. I'll play one more. Because I still have another Fauna video coming at Max Dupe because I'll fight in Tower of Spire. Um, and then I'll have a Max out Witch Queen to see if she's any better. But you already know my thoughts on Witch Queen. It's mainly because the only part of healing that she really gets for everyone is only if um, she has two dupes. And I... Even at two dupes, I just don't feel like getting her to two dupes. It's just a waste, you know? Now, these barriers are a lot smaller, so we should be in business after. Um, okay, so yeah, we'll just... Let's not attack Radas because he's going to taunt us because my luck is just like that, right? Um, but for now, we're good. We're chilling. So I didn't use Radas' ult. What? Okay, well, interesting. Okay. Uh, I really remember... Did I really not use it? Okay. Ah, uh, well, actually, Fauna being taunted really doesn't do much. It ain't that bad of a thing. Pierced her. Okay, well, anyway, now we get a barrier. 100k. I don't think anyone's going through that. Y'all think anyone's going through that? I don't think anyone's going through that. Now, it is annoying that Julius has a second life, but it's whatever. Okay, Mimosa with a 5k damage. Charlotte with a 4k damage. Let's just get through this. Final one. Let's see how much we could do here. Oh, five stacks. Let's go. 86. How did Julius die? He doesn't have res? Oh, okay. I was going to say, like, why doesn't he have res, bro? Um, okay. She has no more barriers, so we're good for this. Does she have a counter? No, she doesn't. Oh, my God. I got very scared. Let's just say that. Okay, we have our barrier again. And we have our damage reduction, so Fauna ain't dying. La Fauna is going to be... Losing her stamina, it's fine though. We're gonna heal Mimosa. And they should have- Oh, fuck you, Radis. I would've- Man. 
That would have been like a lot of damage. Like a lot. But still pretty good. That's about what? Almost 500k considering the second hits 180%. And yeah, um, that's very good. Very, very good from Fauna. Six rounds and I won five. Pretty good ratio. I think I kind of fucked up that game a bit where I lost. But at the same time, they had very high barriers. And Fauna's biggest weakness is barriers. And just being debuffed to the point where she can't really do anything for like two, three rounds. Or just targeting her with barrier removal. So she does have some weaknesses, but they're not that big. And her str strong points are just like much higher than the weaknesses that are available, uh, that are like present. So yeah, let me know what you guys think. Personally, I do really like Fauna. I think, oh nice. I think she is a very good and fun unit. And in PvE, bro, she cooks. So now I'm going to do these and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.